let's see a question thank you vinod patak uh, i'll try to answer it this was a question asked on 2017 december in the part b based on the standard deviation the question is repeated measurements of pb that is lead in lake water samples water samples gave 3.2 5.2 and 7.2 ppb that is parts per billion of lead the standard deviation in measurement of pb is options are given let's see what is a standard deviation standard deviation is nothing but a number which is used to tell the measurement uh, how the measurements of a dupe are spread out from the average or mean or the expected value if the standard deviation a low standard deviation means that uh, the numbers are very close to the average and whereas the high standard deviation means that the numbers are spread out let's see what is the formula for standard deviation general formula for standard deviation is like this that is root of 1 by n sigma 1 to n xi minus mu that is mean square but for samples the general formula is uh, root of uh, 1 by n minus 1 n minus 1 is the bissell correction bissell correction important change in is the bissell correction uh, one minus uh, so it is root of 1 my 1 uh, divided by n minus 1 sigma i 1 to n x i minus x bar square suppose when to use this both of these equation suppose we know it has 20 rose bushes the number of flowers on each bush is calculated is found measurements are done so if we know the uh, number of flowers of the all 20 bushes we use equations of the standard deviation general formula of the standard deviation whereas if only few five of the suppose five samples out of 20 are measured we use the second equation this equation so for samples we use the second equation so in the question it is given that the uh, water sample is taken again in lake water we can only take the sample we cannot you know the wall uh, measurements we cannot take the whole measurements so we take the equation for sample given that uh, the measurements are 3.2 5.2 and 7.2 ppb so we use this equation so let's go to the calculation in the first step what we are what is we are doing is that just minute first step we take the average value that is this this value or we also uh, say that this mean uh, for that we add it up uh, there are three measurements so divided by 3 which will be giving 5.2 in the second step what we are taking we can we have get the average then taking difference from the average that is the first measurement value 3.2 minus 5.2 will giving minus 2 and 5.2 minus 5.2 is 0 and 7.2 minus 5.2 will be giving 2 that we have get this this value then next is taking the squares this is not, nothing but to uh, neglect change the negative sign that is uh, minus 2 becomes 4 and 0 and become 4 the next step is taking the sigma that is adding them so that will be giving 4 plus 0 plus 4 will be giving 8 then in the next dividing them with the n minus 1 that is 8 by 2 8 by 2 which will be giving the value 4 and then next we have to take the square root of the value for taking the square root root 4 square root of 4 is we know that it is 2 so the answer to the question is option 1 2 ppm 2 ppb sorry 
i hope you have understood that question if you like our video please hit the like button and also share and if you want to get more videos please do subscribe thank you